Doctors in Mexico got it wrong when they told the Law family of Solon that their daughter would not survive the car accident she was in late last year. Those doctors just didn't know Andrea Law. All they knew was that the 36-year-old was suffering from a serious injury deep inside her brain. It's an injury she's recovering from right here in Cleveland. Most of her life, Andrea Law has ignored conventional boundaries. In 2002 and 2003, she was a defensive end for the Cleveland Fusion, a professional football team for women. Number 77 channeled that passion and toughness into her job as a police officer with the Tampa, Florida Police Department. She never could have known then how important those qualities would become. Late last year, she and several of her friends went on a cruise and took an excursion into Cozumel, Mexico, where they were involved in a brutal car accident. It was um, probably every mother's worst nightmare. Intuitively, Andrea's mother knew the daughter who had dedicated her career to helping others needed big help to get back to Cleveland. And the surgeon picks up the phone and says, ma'am, you don't understand. She won't make it to Cleveland. Not only did she make it to Cleveland, she's blazed a trail to recovery that amazes her doctors and therapists at Metro Health Medical Center, especially considering how far she's come. She needed two people just to uh, transfer her from a bed into a wheelchair. She needed one person just to hold her in a sitting position once she was up because her sitting balance was, was really off. Now it's a whole different story. She eats and walks and talks and kids and chides. Andrea's hope is to get back to work in some capacity at the Tampa Police Department, but she knows that takes one goal, one step at a time. Despite her upbeat approach to therapy, she's honest about the hard part. Sometimes I see my dog, why me? I get frustrated because I can't do what I used to do. You can get speed later. But her attitude toward boundaries hasn't changed. She's known for it. She beat the odds. Yeah. You did beat the odds. Yeah. You're, you're well aware of that. Yeah. Andrea credits her family and her friends for keeping her motivated. But they'll tell you she's the one motivating everyone around her. It's been a journey. It has been a journey. There's still a few more legs of it to go. But, yeah, I'm very proud of her. Dre, as her friends and family call her, is focusing on getting back to the Tampa Police Department. She was a D.A.R.E. officer at the time of the accident and is working toward a similar position with the department when she goes back.